Alright, that's how we doing it. Alright, there we go. Man, I got an iPhone. I, mean, I don't even know how to work your little phone, man. And it's the old iPhone, too, at that. And don't even know how to flip the camera around. I don't even know how to do it. How to do it. But we got it. That's what I'm looking at. Yeah, try to, you know what I'm saying? I ain't like how the grill came, how it was looking, so I tried to jazz it up a little bit. You know what I'm saying? I tried to jazz it up a little bit. You know? It ain't too much. I got, got some baby rims on there. It, 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 hey, I got to work with what I got. I ain't even going to complain. I ain't about to say nothing about it. I ain't even going to complain. Starting to get there. Yeah, I call myself about to put the, uh, the door speakers in and whatnot today. I got some pieces laying all through the back. Yeah, we get we getting somewhere. baby stepping it still oh I don't even know why I got this I was showing I was showing uh I was trying to I don't know why I got this up here I was showing somebody I wasn't even gonna do that yet I wasn't even gonna show you that yet I'm just now noticing this up there but just trying to you know what I'm saying I'm gonna, I'm gonna get in here and do some things and clean it up a little bit and you know remix it a little bit that that's something you know i just try it out but man since i gave you that piece then i gotta give you the other piece then man i gotta give you the other piece i wasn't even about to do that i wasn't even about to do that so this piece gonna sit up Sit up in here. You know what I'm saying? You know how it go. I wasn't even gonna do it. this. Is my first time really seeing it like that. I wasn't even gonna do that. But there you go. You know. So when I get my stuff together up under there, clean it all up, add my little fixings. You, you see, you see what I'm, you see how I'm thinking. You kind of, you kind of see how I'm thinking. I'm just trying to clean it up a little bit, you know. I ain't got no interior yet. I mean, I got the back seat and all the, you know what I'm saying. I got all the fixings, but man, I'm pimping me some new interior, man. Look at that. Look at that. Now, the dash and all that ain't bad. But the, uh, like the carpet and all, you know what I'm saying? The seats. The headrest is brand new. But them seats. The back seats ain't, uh, that back seat ain't bad. It's been so long since I seen the bottom seat, I can't even remember what it looked like. I know that seat over there ain't that bad. I, I know this is the worst seat right here, man. You see all the man sliced up, man. You know what I'm saying? Look like I was looking for something in that thing. Hey, I'm about to get in here. I gotta, man. Shh. I had to take some stuff back out, man, because it was it. I wasn't doing it right. I wasn't doing it right. I was trying to rush and get back outside, so I just got to kind of. I, I caught myself putting stuff together that shouldn't even be in here to begin with. So I was like, no, I gotta take it out. I gotta put them brand new, 
a lot of these wires is brand new, but some of these wires is not brand new. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, nah, I'm not doing this. Like, I'm using white, like, man, come on, pimping. Like, I don't even want to even do, you know what I'm saying? I know we're just test running some stuff, but mm, no. I ain't doing none of that. I ain't doing this battery. I gotta take I gotta take some stuff back out and do it a better way. That's what I'm gonna say. I'm gonna just do it a better way. This, this ain't this ain't how I want to do it. You know what I'm saying? That ain't how we doing it. You you gonna see how we go? I'm gonna show you. But we ain't doing it like that. I like how I did them tail lights. Them joints is all right. Them joints is all right. But I made a lot, I made I made a lot of mistakes on on here, but man, for my first time really getting it in like this, like like my first time, my first time painting and doing body work, the little bit of body work that I did do, I did do. You know, I gotta give myself more credit, cause I did do some good some good body work, uh, especially on that wheel well, and I made it look a lot better than it did. I give myself more credit. First time putting the top on. You know what I'm saying? I didn't put TVs in before, but it's my first time doing a head red. It's my first time doing a lot of stuff on the car. And we still ain't even, even done, okay? Because I ain't even hit the engine yet. I, there's a lot of stuff I ain't done yet. But man, this is stuff that I, I have done that I ain't never done before. Man, this is, it turned out okay. So imagine if I uh, keep practicing on my skills, you know what I'm saying? Keep practicing on my skills. And I think I have to give a big shout out to Sprayway because he gave me a lot of tips. It would not have uh, came out this good, as good as it has, if it wasn't for him, you know? So you gotta tap in with him. He break he break it down and really really show you how to do some stuff. So man, I really appreciate that. That would have some good knowledge. And he's still dropping. But well, man, for my first time, yeah, I did, you know what I'm saying? And I still got I mean I still gotta put all the, you know what I'm saying, and blow it. And I got some, I, I still got all my old emblems and trim. The only thing that's new is the little trim right there on the doors. That's the only thing that's new trim. Everything else is old. And I, don't, I really don't even want to put it on. That's why it ain't on. I really want some new trim, but Pippin can't afford all this stuff right now. I got, I got to baby step this stuff. I be getting too into it. I can't mess up and, and you know and spend a whole entire bag like I you know what I'm saying like I I would if I could. Hey pimp, that's what you gotta watch out for. Nowadays, that's what you need to watch out for. Young ones be the one knocking stuff down. You gotta be careful, especially out here. <laughs> but he mad so so crazy crazy little mom he mad <laughs> yeah but man they've been thugging over here the little store the little store i go to a couple blocks away like four blocks away man they uh i didn't you know i didn't even check it out but i, I drove past it they had a uh, a crazy little shooting up there. You know what I'm saying? I, I ain't see the shooting, but the reason why I say that, I seen all the little uh, the little the little uh, numbers that they be putting over the bullets. It looked like they 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 had some bullets in that thing. I see, I'm trying to get a little cleaned up in here. Yeah, man, I'm tired of seeing cigarette butts, man. Get on my nerves. That's a habit that I need to break. Jesus. But yeah, I wired up the speakers wrong. Pimping is just trying, trying to rush and come outside so I can see y'all. That's all I was trying to do. 
But I'm like, man, I ain't put the, you know what I'm saying? I ain't do it. I ain't do this right. So we had to take, we, we, hey, I had to call a timeout. Mm-hmm. I had to call a timeout. Now, this ain't going right. This ain't what I'm supposed to be doing. You know what I'm saying? I have been through this before. But now, we got to put this together a little bit better. Just a little bit better. That wiring got to be right. You know what I'm saying? I got to get my distribution blocks on that thing. On all, Man, look, stop. Mm-mm. I call a timeout on the play. So now, now, now we back online. So I think I'm about to, uh, that's what I'm about to start doing is, is, is doing all these wires. Doing all these wires. Man, who is coming now? Yeah, doing all these wires and, uh, and, uh, getting this trunk together and getting this engine together. Putting the door panels on. That's what I'm about to get to doing. That alternator is messing me, man, that alternator is messing my life up, man. So I'm about to order, yeah, I'm about to order some parts. Because it means nothing if your car ain't running. I don't care what it look like. If your car can't even make it to the next city, if you crossing fingers, <laughs> going to the next city over, Man, you ain't, man, you ain't, nah, man. I want confidence, you know, when, when, when I pull her out. You know, I want to know that she, 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 she hitting right. You know, things gonna mess up and all that. I understand all that. But, nah, she gonna, nah, nah, she right good. And she, you know, I think I got an air leak. I know I need some, uh, I seen it too. The, uh, what was it, yesterday, two days ago? I got a leak in, uh, in that, in that muffler over there. Yeah, I see you, pimp. Yeah, pimp and tunnel. I see you. Watch it. But I got a leak over there. I seen it dripping out. But I wanted to get new exhaust anyway. This guy had the duels on it. This ain't even got no duels. This joint gotta have the duels on it. You know? Yeah, this joint got to have the duels on it. You just give me a minute. You just give it a minute. But yeah, I need that alternator. I'm going to show you what I'm about to do. I ain't going to tell you anything. But you, you, you see what it's looking like. Don't get me wrong, it's it's running. That alternator garbage though, and it's running. And I, you see, you see how I did that. Like, come on, pimp. Like, you see, you know I'm a, you know. I ain't gonna say nothing about it, but I ain't even do it right. I just, I gotta get the crimper. How you doing? Good, how are you? I'm alright. I, I gotta get the crimper. That's the only thing I'm missing. Hold on, you think I'm playing? I ain't playing. Let's see, I got the piece right here. I, I need two more. I need two more, then I gotta get my little crew. Fuck out! So I, can, so I can put them on right. You know what I'm saying? Because I ain't even put some of these wires I ain't, you know what I'm saying? The, the wires I got going to the frame, or how many I got going to the frame? I think I got uh, three, three zero gauge wires. Going to the frame, one in the front, and two in the back on both sides in the trunk. Mm-hmm. So I need to get uh the ones I got going to the frame, I need to get them right. As well as that uh up here. As well as uh that power on the alternator. On that ground wire on the alternator, you know I gotta get that right. We ain't doing that. Uh, my apologies, pimp. Then I need my distribution blocks on here. You know what I'm saying? This one and a couple of them in the trunk. I need to get those on there. 
Yeah, man, I'm messing up. I messed up. You know what I'm saying? I got the man, I got the cutting up. But no, man, I ain't hey. I'ma get it right. I ain't going nowhere. I was I wasn't thirsty, thirsty. Just trying to have him some fun. Pimpin, hey, Pimpin had to get set up. I told, hey, I told you it's wild, wild west out here. I don't know what, hey, I don't know what, hey, I don't know what you're doing. I know, I don't know you, so I don't really know what you're doing. I gotta get ready. <laughs> Pimpin got to get ready. You understand me? Mm-hmm. If I would have known he was going to step on the gas just like that, man, I would have showed y'all what he was doing. Or give y'all a little picture of a little car. I can't even tell you what type of car it was. I was focused. I was focused on the game playing. I don't know what kind of car it was. But I know it was one of them little, you know what I'm saying? Little racing, little, little, little sports joint that they be liking. You had all your wheels on Yup. I got I got all the wheels on. Nice. Pretty soon you'll be driving it down the street. Yeah. I we 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 gotta we gotta do it right though. Oh yeah. I understand that. I have three brothers. Yeah. What the hell was that? Yeah, I I don't know, but I I sure enough heard it. <laughs> My neighbor said, what the hell was that? Come on, man. 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 Come on, for my first time, you got to give me something. Hey, even with my mess-ups. I didn't mess up. I didn't got all kind of, you know, stuff I could have done better. But, man, what, next time I do it, watch how I do it better, though. You think I'm playing with you? Yeah, I'm playing. Yeah. Oh, that's my man. That's my man and my, uh, this is my little Mexican in this goddamn, what is that? I call that the little uh, Fast and Furious joint. That's the little Fast and Furious joint. Man, if I'm about to tell him to pop the hood, pop the hood over. I'm going to see if you pop the hood over. What are you doing? Who you got in there? Let me see if we got somebody in there. Oh, no. Hey, sir. What's up, man? How you doing? I'm all right. You doing work in the car? Yeah, I, I think so. Uh, yeah, nice. Yeah, he got his food. He ain't about to play with me today. He's gone. Yeah, we, we going to see. Are you, are you know when somebody pull up with that food? You know you ain't about to sit out here and politic with, with, with nobody. You about to get in there and get right. I'll talk to you in a minute. I ain't, I ain't even gonna bother him right now. You know what I'm saying? Pop out this road pass. You know what I'm saying? I had to, hey. I had to pay him no mind. Like, hey, I had to, hey. Hey, I, I, had, hey, I had to mind my business right quick. They, hey, you know they were looking right at the pimp, too. So, you know, if I would have, uh, Flick the camera on them, they would have definitely came over here. Hey man, what hey man, what you what you doing? Done. It would have been something. It would have been something, cause you know I don't like all the hey. So, hey, leave, hey, leave me alone. <laughs> hey, anybody in the city that know me, hey, you better leave me alone. I don't care about none of that. That's why I thank God, man, he ain't put me in that in none of them positions uh, with the police to do me wrong. Cause I can't help it. I can't help it, man. I hey, I stand up for what I believe in. And I don't care about what I don't care about what I'm against. 
I could be in a losing situation. I still gotta stand up for what I believe in. I just can't help it. it hey, it's been, I've been like that since a kid. You better ask my daddy. I've been like that since a kid. Like, nah, pimping ain't just going like that. So you're gonna have to do me. And you do me wrong, you just gonna have to do me. Cause I can't help but to, hey, I can't help but to, hey, but to be me. It's not even a thought. I think, hey, hey, but hey, hey, we positive. Hey, we positive nowadays, man. You see what I'm trying to do? You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to get stuff right with my kids and get this money a little, you know what I'm saying? A little piece of this money and play with my little toys. That's all I'm trying to do. I ain't trying to mess with nobody. You better leave me alone. And they really didn't spin the block, too. I like that. And I like them. They ain't spinning the block. They ain't come over here messing with me. You see, I ain't got no plates on. He was sitting right there at that corner. Looking at me. I took one glance at him and turned my head. Fuck out of here. Get out of here, pimp. Leave me alone. But yeah, yeah, he see me, he see it. He see, I ain't got no hood on that joint. I ain't got no plate on that joint. He could have came over here and messed with me for something simple. Just cause, just to see what's, what's going on. He, hey, he, he left me alone. That's how God worked. <laughs> Leave me alone. Let me be safe out here. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, now I gotta get this joint together. I really don't even, man. I've been, I've been really uh, slacking on putting that trim, that trim back on. I gotta put the trim back on on the doors up there and down there. I've been slacking because it's like, man, I really want all new trim. You know what I'm saying? It'll hurt me to put the same trim on there, knowing that it's raggedy. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Just knowing that it's right. I don't like this trim. Can't look at that. I mean, it's, it's, it's little, I mean it's, it is what it is. Don't get me wrong. It's on there. You know what I'm saying? But it ain't crispy. You know what I'm saying? Like that crispy shine. It ain't that crispy shine. Pimp. I feel like I'm, you know what I'm saying? It should have that crispy shine. You know what I'm saying? But I guess I'm going to have to baby step it. Cause I ain't even looked at it and see how much uh where I can get it from or how, how much I'm gonna have to put down on this joint and get I don't even know nothing about none of that. I ain't even look at it. I I ain't got it though. So it's like man, I'm supposed to be baby stepping this thing. So it's like man, do I just use the same stuff that I got and then baby step it and, and just hit it, you know what I'm saying, one watt. We got action. Hold on. Give me a minute. All right, we all right. But man, do I just, you know what I'm saying? Like, do I just use the same trim? Or do we just, what we gonna do? Well, we're like, man, I'm supposed to be baby stepping this thing. I'm a baby stepping. Man, I don't even know if I'm gonna be able to do that, man. I'm gonna try to put the, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try to put the same trim back up here. And, and then, you know what I'm saying? Later on down the line, you know what I'm saying? I, I'll, I'll remix the trim. Cause I need, I need door handles. You know what I'm saying? I want all new door handles, all new trim and emblems and all that, man. You know what I'm saying? Man, I got some, hey, I got some, I, I don't even know if I'm, I ain't even gonna say nothing about it. I ain't gonna say nothing about it. Oh, okay. Uh, hey, but her name is Jasmine. That's what I've been calling her. You know what I'm saying? Since I got her. Just Jasmine. What's up, man? Yeah, this Jasmine right here. 
okay? It, hey, give it one, hey, she stamped too. I ain't got the stamp on there, but you give me one minute, I'm about to stamp her. I'm about to stamp, I'm about to stamp, stamp Jasmine on this thing. So you, so you know, you know I ain't gonna even be playing with it. But yeah, I gotta get my wires right. Cause we ain't about to have no fire. Hey, I'm trying not to have no fire in this thing. If anything goes wrong, I need them distribution blocks in this thing. Yo, you know what I'm saying? Like, man, this, look at this dog. That thing look nasty. That thing look nasty. Hey, check out what I'm about to do, though. You see it, though, don't need, hey, you see all this, right? All right, now check me out. I wasn't supposed to give you that over there. You know what I'm saying? I wasn't even, you know what I'm saying? But, hey. So, 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 if I got that looking like that, you know I gotta, I gotta bag that up. You know I gotta, hey, you know I gotta bag that, hey, come on, man, I can't pop my hood and, 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 and have that looking like that, but then be sitting over here like, yeah, she running, though. Man, if you don't get out of here looking stupid, hey, hold on. Watch, what, man, look. It's, it's not it, though. Don't get me wrong. It ain't it, you know what I'm saying? But but it's it, for my first round, man. It's okay. It's okay. Now now when I put some money behind this, when I put some money behind the next build, just imagine what I, what, what I could what I could do where I could take it. Cause, Cause this is what I'm doing. This is what I'm doing without the money. Pimpin' Pimpin ain't got no money. This is what I'm doing without the money. So imagine if I really, you know what I'm saying? Get my money up and really be able to do something. You know, practice on my skills. Get my skills better. Boy, I come with a nice deal. I want to do a frame off, but I ain't ready yet. I respect it. I respect it and I would like it one day, but I, ain't, I know I ain't ready yet. I don't got enough patience just yet for something like that because you talking about like like a frame off build that's gonna take me that's something that i'll I, for me to do it i gotta i gotta take a long i gotta take some time i gotta take me you know what i'm saying however long it take you know it's gonna take some years though you know what i'm saying like a frame off build everything going back on gotta be brand new and crispy perfect yeah, it's gonna take me some years. I don't even know how many, like, I'm, I'm, I'm figuring five, I don't even know, but it's gonna take, it's gonna take some time. I don't, I don't, man, I ain't ready yet. My mind ain't ready yet. Cause this, hey, this ain't nothing. And it, and I, and it's been, uh, it's been almost two years. If I'm not mistaken, it's been almost two years. I think in, uh, the end, the end of October will make it two years that this car ain't been on the road. So, so even in the midst of doing this, it's been like, man, come on, man, I'm trying to get outside. You know, I wanted to get outside last summer, but then I'm like, man, you know what? I ain't tripping. You know what I'm saying? So I, I went ahead and skipped last summer, just knowing that I wasn't gonna make it. But in this summer that came around, I'm like, Psh, pimping, I know I'm out here. Stop playing with me, I know I'm out here. And look, <laughs> pimping still ain't out here. And I really thought, I just, I really thought I was gonna be out here. But you know what? I had to calm it down. When you messing with these cars and, and really putting them together, uh, up under the hood, maintenance wise, and you know, you're doing engine swaps and, you know, tweaking different things. Man, you know that, man. If anybody know, you know this take time. Uh, you're going to run into to, to obstacles probably. You're going to probably have to get something redone. Like all types of stuff. You don't, man, it's, it's a lot of things that go on with putting these cars together. You know, sometimes you can get in and get out. 
That, that's why, hey, I ain't never done this much work on a car before. So now that I do this, I see why, I can see why people uh, this, this, this buy, they stun the ride straight out. They buy cars that's already put together, ready to go, we hitting the street. Because of the, 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 the patience and, and the money that comes along with it, it, all the stuff that comes along with it, like, pimp, I didn't have paint on my hands, like, 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 what's the day? Three days, two, three days. Still can't get all the paint off. I'm talking about this thing. Hey, it comes with it comes with a lot. Some people just like, look, I'm about to just buy this straight out the mud. Like, let me give you the whole forty. Let me give you the whole seventy. You know what I'm saying? My man, my man's car. I got I got two buddies. They they joined to like uh up there uh hundred hundred thousand hundred thirty thousand. Like people coming straight out the mud. Like man, let me get that. I don't even got time. I'm trying to hit the strip. I see why. I'm like, dang, man, why people be wanting to, to pay so much for, you know what I'm saying, another bill? And that type of money that they paying, they could really build it, you know what I'm saying, their self. But what I see, the time, the patience, and the, trying to figure out what you going to do, how you going to do it. You be having to get custom stuff done. It take time to figure out the game plan sometimes. You know what I'm saying? And then you got to go through so many different people. There's, there's not a lot of people that do everything. So you be having to go to the engine, man. Sometimes you be having to go to the transmission, man. Then you got to go to the interior, man. Then you got to go to the music, man. And then you got to go to see somebody else about this. Then you got to see somebody else about that. Then you got to get it tuned. Then you, you know what I'm saying? You be having to go through so many different people and their schedules. You know what I'm saying? And and how long they how far they backed up and all that. Boy, look, listen. Boy, you gotta be you gotta have thick skin for this. This this ain't this ain't petty. Even though this is petty, even this is not even petty. Like <laughs> you gonna have a you, you still gotta have a little bit of change for this. You still, to get where, I'm, where I got to, you still gonna have to have a piece of change. Uh, you gonna have time, patience, oh my goodness. And I ain't even made it nowhere. You know what I'm saying? Oh uh, yeah, I think, how, hey, how much it cost to get a, uh, the, the top put in the Lincoln that didn't even have, have a sunroof? You know what I'm saying? Like how much it cost at the shop to, to get that popped in? You know what I'm saying? It costs something, you know what I'm saying? Uh, 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 you know what I'm saying? The price is, you know what I'm saying? It's big to, 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 you know what I'm saying? Some people, some people, it's just petty change, but it's still gonna cost something. You know what I'm saying? You don't have to pay you a band, two bands, I don't know what you're gonna have to pay, but you're gonna have to bend and pay something. You ain't gonna be able to get it done for 50, 100 hours. You can't get that. You, you still gotta buy the top. You know what I'm saying? You gotta buy the top itself. You, you know what I'm saying? Then you gotta get somebody to put that 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 joint in. You see what I'm saying? Like how much is that gonna cost? So just that alone, I already know you you gotta you you spending two 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 plus two bands plus just for the top. The paint, you know what I'm saying? It ain't the best painted joint, but but if you was to go to Mako. And get a paint like this that's flipping colors with the pearl in there. Okay? Door jams. I got the hood jams. Uh, under the hood. I got all these little pieces painted. You know what I'm saying? I got all kind of... I got pieces that you ain't... That, that's, that's tucked away in the house. But I got so many pieces that's painted to this car. So when you add all that stuff up and go to make them like, hey, paint all of this. And then the little rust that I... I actually did good and took care of, uh, you know, tail lights. You know what I'm saying? Like, go to Mako and tell them to paint all this stuff up for you. <laughs> you go to Mako and tell them, you know what I'm saying, the the, uh, the back shelves. Hey, go to Mako and tell them to paint all this stuff that I didn't paint it. Tell them to do that for you. 
do you know how much they're gonna try to charge you count when you're talking about a basic paint job a basic paint job here in minnesota you know what i'm saying just like stuff like this they won five to seven thousand dollars just for 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 uh you know factory paints they won like five seven thousand dollars crazy here in minnesota crazy so you go into something like this on top of all them little extra little little pieces that i got that you're gonna see at the end of this build do you know how you know, you know how much they're gonna try to charge you way way over ten thousand count and then you gotta tell them to come up with this like come up with this you gotta tell them to do certain stuff so they don't have to custom do it themselves Pippa, you pay way over ten thousand at mako five tvs you gotta get somebody to hook five tvs up amps epic center you know what i'm saying subs extra wires you know what i'm saying like i got wires coming from the from the uh from the frame you know what i'm saying like i got my uh i got my battery yeah i got my battery grounded to the frame that's what i forgot to tell you i got my battery grounded to the frame a zero gauge i still got the original wires uh hooked up but but i added a zero gauge uh ground wire to the frame for my battery up front uh, I got the alternator grounded out with a zero gauge and I got a uh I got uh two zero gauges in the in the trunk from the frame one on the left and one on the right so I'm talking about man you, hey go to the music man go to e any music shop hey tell them man hey, you need the big three under the hood Tell them you need five TVs, one in the dash, two, two visors, two headrests. Tell them you need the music, two amps. I, I think just for like one amp, I think for one amp, uh, they normally charge like 150. I think to install it, you gotta get the wires and all this stuff. You know what I'm saying? So, you gonna be with, with, with all the wires and just getting the amps and Epic Center hooked up. You know what I'm saying? You, you don't be looking at like six, seven, like you don't be looking at, you gotta get extra batteries in the trunk. I'm putting two, uh, two batteries in the trunk. So, when you get to adding all that stuff up, you know what I'm saying? That's probably, that, that's, you, well, you know it's over a thousand dollars. You know what I'm saying? But if you, don't, you, you already know the, the, the wires alone is gonna cost you. All the wires alone, all the distribution, but all this little stuff. And then I gotta buy the equipment to do it myself. So you gotta factor that in. I like I'm doing it myself. Uh, as I as I go on buying what I need to do it myself. But if you was to go somewhere else, how much how much you think they gonna charge you? Any which way you you go, it's not gonna be cheap. <clears throat> so you gotta be willing. To take that ride you know what i'm saying you gotta be willing to take hey, take that ride regardless if you gotta pay for it or you gonna do it yourself either way it's still gonna cost you you just come out a lot better when you do it yourself but then you gotta factor in that time and and, and, and whatever else you go through you know what i'm saying so yeah, if you're doing it yourself, uh, you might come out cheaper than having somebody else do it. But then you factor, you know, adding this type of project into your life schedule. You know what I'm saying? You're trying to add some stuff like this into your life schedule. Your life schedule already filled up before this comes. So then you gotta, you gotta add time to do this. And then, do you know how much time this takes? You know, I could have been working on this crazy every day, but man, the time and, and being exhausted. This, this, man, there's so many times I got off of work. 
I didn't get off of work. Uh, I used to get off at like 11.30 at night. By 12, 12, 10, by like, not even that, really by, really by like 11.40. Like, ele I say by 12. 12 o'clock, during the winter time, I used to be in here. I didn't been in here t since like two, three in the morning. I didn't watch the sun come up in this thing. I've been working on that car since the sun then came up, okay? Like I didn't put so many hours working on this car. And a lot of hours went to just having to, to learn how to do stuff. Doing something, it's not turning out how I wanted to turn out, so I gotta redo it. When I redo it, I gotta buy more material and that's more time. A lot more time, because now I gotta, you know, like sand the car back down and then redo it again. So sanding the car back down, that cost me money. I gotta buy stuff to, to mask it back off, more tape, more sandpaper, more time to sand it down. Uh, then I gotta buy, you know, make sure I got more paint, more print. And then, and then redo it all again. You know, I, I didn't have to do that like three times, I think. You know what I'm saying? Not knowing, you know what I'm saying? L learning and, and not having all the knowledge to really do it. And, and to tell you the truth, the very first time I painted this car, it turned out perfect, but I just didn't have the right clear coat. If I would have had the right clear coat, this car would have been further along a long time ago. But I'm, you know what I'm saying? I'm using the wrong uh, type of clear coat and it wasn't giving me the shine I wanted. So then I got to doing something else. I got to doing something else. You know what I'm saying? It, it took me a long time to figure out how to get what I was trying to get. You know what I'm saying? And I've been going back and forth and working on it so long. And then it's been in the, in this tight space. I'm still in here moving stuff around. You know, uh, you know, I didn't, I didn't make the car. You know what I'm saying? I turned the base on one day. I turned the base on one day in here, and uh, I had this joint hanging on the wall. And this joint was hanging just like this. Hold on. And that drone was hanging up there just like that. It was on there better than that. But it was just like that. When I turned the base on, it fell right on the hood. On, on the opposite side that I got painted. You know what I'm saying? Because it's all messed up. I got to redo all that. But, but other than here, you know what I'm saying? I painted this a while back. So up under here, uh, yeah, so now I got like two nicks up under here. Just, you know what I'm saying? Just not having the proper space to really have stuff put away so it don't get damaged before I put it back on the car. You know what I'm saying? I gotta redo all this. It's all messed up. But just the, uh, you know, having the proper space to, you know what I'm saying? Like I didn't learn so much in the midst of doing what I was doing. So it, man, I, I put a lot, I dedicated a lot of time in my life, Jesus. To up the standards, pimp. Up the standards and go for it and see what I come up with. You know? Because I could have messed everything up. I could have just, I could have just messed the whole paint up, car up. Even doing the sanding and grinding stuff out, I could have just messed up a whole bunch of stuff. Just because I ain't know how to do it right. I could have cut the top all messed up. Pimp, I could have messed up all on the top and it wouldn't even have nothing to be able to put on the top. So if I would have messed up this top, how would I get it fixed? Pimp, if I would have messed up on this top, then how would I would have got this fixed, Pimp? I would have had to put a, I would have had to cut it and get it welded and put a whole new another piece on top of this joint if I would have messed up and couldn't even get it right. Dang, I ain't even think about it like But Pimmy got it right. You know what I'm saying? It wasn't easy. Don't get me wrong. It wasn't just like pop. 
being, you know what I'm saying? I had to, you know what I'm saying? And, but but you, I took this top on and off like three times since I had it. But man, hey man, hey, sheesh. But look, I ain't gonna lie. I'm about to sit here. This is a nice day out here. So I got the day off work. I got the day off work. What pay might I add? Thank you. You understand me? But I'ma still try to do something. You know, I'm gonna try to put the I'm gonna try to put the door speakers on. See see how that go. You know, I'm gonna try to put these door speakers back on. I need to get this trim back on. Cause coming up this weekend, I'm trying to focus on uh, this engine. It's pretty much the engine, the inside, and the trunk. I'm trying to I'm trying to get that. Cause once we get that completed. We can go on our first test ride real quick. You know what I'm saying? And, and, you know what I'm saying? I got so many pieces to put back on. Like, pin this pieces I forgot about. But I wonder how this whole front piece gonna look when I get it all hidden right. I don't even know. We gonna find out though. Yeah, we gonna find out. I want to get that music. I got to get that music right, Pimp. This ain't going to be no fun if Pimp can't have his music right. I need my, you know what I'm saying? I need my music hit right. You know, I wasn't even planning on, I wasn't even planning on, uh, planning on painting these, but man, I, I accidentally got paint on them. So I said, man, dang, here we go. You know, these joints go up in, in this joint right here, you know what I'm saying? So I wasn't even planning on doing this. But I'm like, man, I accidentally got a little bit of little bit, bit of glisten on there. And I said, you know what? I'm going to just go ahead and do it. It don't even matter. Because I want to repaint this car anyway. So I'm not even really tripping on a lot of stuff. Because I want to redo the paint again because I feel like I can do better. So I really want to repaint the car. But I'm like, you know what? I ain't gonna bust it down right now. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go back through and, and get my engine and, and you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna get all this, this other stuff that I got going on. Cause just this paint cost me a lot of time. Okay? So I'm like, man, you know what? I'm gonna go, go I'm gonna move ahead, get a whole lot of other stuff done because you know, you know, uh, spending so much time uh, going to different places, you know, they gonna, uh, you know, doing engine. I, I know I'm gonna I'm put some scratches on here, you know. I know I'm gonna put, you know what I'm saying, some scratches on here. Uh, you know, I got so many kids, grandkids and all that, you know, they gonna be, they, they, when they really come out, you know, they probably gonna be looking at it, touching it, mess around and scratch it with a toy in their hand or something. So, I'm gonna wait till it go through all them hands, in and out the shop, you know what I'm saying? Cause I wanna just double check on the wheel alignment. I, I gotta get some sway bar tips on, 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 something on this front end. Uh, I got a couple of things I wanna do it ain't bad, don't get me wrong, but I, there's a couple things I need to do. Uh, and then, just cause, I mean, the, the wheel's straight, it, it rides right. But, I, you know, once I get that, that front end uh, worked on, I want to go ahead and uh, get a, get another wheel alignment just to make sure we, you know what I'm saying, we on point. Uh, I got to get some new tires in the back. I put the tires I don't like. I hate this tire. But I put the tires I don't like in the back. You know what I'm saying? You see that joint in there with me. I hate that tire. You know what I'm saying? So I put the, I put the good tires in the front. Put the bad tires in the back. So we gotta get two, uh, two new, uh, two brand new tires in the back. You know what I'm saying? I've been eating on this tire, boy. I'm talking about, I mean, man, on these tires, with these rims on there, I didn't put so many miles on this thing. 
Cause I had these rims and tires on a different car. And I'm talking about, you talk about driving out the city. <sighs> Camp, I was out the city every week. I'm talking about, I was acting a fool when I had these rims on this other car, pimp. But yeah, man, you go to the, man, you go to them people and tell them to get to doing, painting all these little, all these little pieces that I didn't paint it like up in here. You know what I'm saying? Like these joints right here, these joints. I got so many, wait till you see all these little pieces that I've been painting. I'm trying to paint it inside these joints right here. You know what I'm saying? Wait till you get to seeing all the pieces that I really painted for this car. And then just, and then just stuff that I didn't have on there before. Like I had to put me a, uh, I got me some base going in here. And I want to try to create me some airflow. You know what I'm saying? So, I got me a mall. I cut me a little hole through that joint right there, man. Try to get me some airflow through that thing. So now I gotta make it all pretty and whatnot when you look at it. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? But you go to the shop and have them do this work. You know what I'm saying? I got the G joints. You know what I'm saying? I did these joints. This whole little mechanism in here don't come like that. You know what I'm saying? Even inside the oh, you can't even see the hole. You know what I'm saying? Even inside this little mirror, mirror. You know what I'm saying? On the mirror trim. You know what I'm saying? I hit that joint. You know, I ain't do the best of the best. You know what I'm saying? Job, but I did a decent job. You know what I'm saying? I think. I think I did a decent job. You know what I'm saying? I get a lot of people uh, giving me compliments and all this stuff. You know what I'm saying? But the thing about it, on top of that, man, I like it. You know what I'm saying? That's the thing about it. Is I, I think it's, it's kind of cool. And then when I just look at it, it's just like, pimp, I did a lot. I just, I did it. You know what I'm saying? I did a lot. I, I, my hands didn't touch so much of this car. It just feel like I, I just did it. I just did it. You know what I'm saying? I don't even know if you can see. You can't even see them joints. But I got sprinkles. I got a little bit of sprinkles in these for no reason. You ain't even gonna be able to see them. You know what I'm saying? But they was rusty and ugly. You know what I'm saying? So I just cleaned them up. You know what I'm saying? I just cleaned them up a little bit. You can't even see no glitz in them. But they got a little bit of sprinkle in there. Even though they're going to be covered up. I just try to, you know what I'm saying, do a little bit of a little bit. You know. It's my first time. You know what I'm saying? I got the ins You know what I'm saying? I got the inside of the. You know what I'm saying? Like when you get paint jobs from Mako. I, I don't even think they paint. I don't even think they going through it and, and painting this right here. You know what I'm saying? And all this up here gonna be covered up. But I just, you know what I'm saying, I just, for no reason. That was just when I, before I got to hit in the car, I was painting here a little bit. You know what I'm saying? I, I don't, you know what I'm saying, we don't even gotta worry about nothing in here because all this is gonna be covered up. But I still did a look, you know what I'm saying? And in the trunk, like I don't even think, like when you go to make or you paint out, like this costs extra. You know what I'm saying? They ain't paint the inside of your trunk right there. And then, and then you got the, you know what I'm saying? Like, a lot of stuff they is not doing. You got to pay for that. So just to get a basic, like, man, just to get a basic paint with all these pieces painted. Like, that's going to cost something. This type of paint, pimp, you paying well, way, you paying way, well over 10. You paying way over 10,000 for something like that. Okay, now it ain't the best of the best, but god dang it, it's something, and I like it. It's something, and I like it, and I did it myself. That's what, see, the paint is not really all that. And, and the reason why I say that is because I watch people, I, I, I'm in tune with people that do real good, solid paint, like, like Sprayway, you know what I'm saying? If you don't know, tap into them. But like Sprayway, 
does a real official paint job. So th that's that's what I'm looking at. So that's what I'm I'm on stuff like that. You know, True Grit does does real outrageous paint job. He do some good paints. Uh, uh, he painted a uh, rich boy. What's it? Is it rich boy? I hope I said that right. He don't get mad at me like rich boy. Yeah, I think it's rich boy. You know, my man, uh, throw some bees on that bitch. Yeah, I think that's my man, Rich Boy. He painted his car. His car is a crazy color. His car is a crazy color. He said he mixed all types of pearls together and, and, and hit that joint. And then uh, even my man, uh, Sugar Man, on that. He got a nice cutlass, 71 cutlass. I mean, don't get me wrong. The T-Rex is painted nice. But that 71 cutlass got that outrageous paint job. And I'm talking about that thing. That thing too pretty. He need to get a fine for that. I'm talking about, I don't even know, man. I think he said, uh, who painted that? PC? I think his man, man, I painted the PC or something. Hey, look, check me out. Hey, tap in the sugar man on there and look at that 71 colors and tell me that ain't no, no real paint job. Now, now, when you're looking at them cars and them type of cars that them individuals paint, then you look at this. This ain't that. You know what I'm saying? It's all right. Don't get me wrong. It's all right. I just call it what I call it. That's just how I feel about it. It's all right, but it's not that. So I'm not going to say like, oh, you know what I'm saying? It's that. You know what I'm saying? But the reason why it's that to me is because I did it, pimp. You know? That's why I feel like, man, this month, this, now this is that. Just because I did it, it, it feel good. It make me feel good, I like it. You know what I'm saying? It surprised myself, you know what I'm saying? Cause this is something I want to do. I'm like, man, I'm doing my own paint. When I come back out, I thought I was gonna come back out the following summer. <laughs> I'm like, man, when I come back out, man, I, can, I, I can't do factory paint, you know what I'm saying? Cause I can take, I can take, I can take factory paint and clean it up you know, dress the car up with a little bit of fixings and have it looking clean and just decent. But I'm like, man, I want, I want, I want my own. You know what I'm saying? I want my own, but at the same time, I want to do it myself. And I don't like the prices on top of that. No, I pimp can't afford them prices. You crazy? That's not where I'm at. I can't give you no seven thousand dollars. Well. It, it, if this was where I was going, you know what I'm saying? And they told, you know, this was going to cost more than that seven piece. You know, they would have told me something different. You know what I'm saying? Even if I didn't get all them pieces painted and I just wanted to get the car painted with, with, the, with the back shields for the rim, man, I don't care if they would have told me eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. You know what I'm saying? Pivot ain't got that. I don't got it for you. you hey, look, look, listen, let me tell you something. Look, I ain't got no eight for you. I don't got no seven for you to do this. You know what I'm saying? Hey, my life real. I don't even, I ain't even, I ain't ready yet. So <laughs> I did it myself and still ended up spinning. <laughs> Look at that. I said I, I gotta throw this stuff away uh, when I go to the trash. Cause that stuff you can't even put in the, in your regular trash. Hey, hey, man. I want I want to have the knowledge and the ability to do this type of stuff myself just because I'm into it, but I thought I was going to cut the cost. I still messed up. I could have went to make y'all because I kept redoing the paint. I didn't redid the paint like three times, trying to get it, trying to get it right. And then I didn't learn how to really get it until the end. Yeah, I ain't, really, I ain't really start doing a good job that that was really like surprising, like really nice until I did like the uh, the flip side of this hood and in, uh, in the trunk. That's when I'm like, okay, now I'm starting to get everything lined up, right? I'm starting to get it. I'm starting to know how to, yeah, yeah. You feel me? But man, man, check me out, man. I did it myself. And I feel good about it. I'm starting to feel good about it. Normally when I think about it, I, I be feeling like, man, a headache. Like, man, I gotta go put some more work in. I gotta go put some more work in. I gotta put some more work in. So it's like, man, I ain't been able to sit back and just be like, man, you did. You, it's looking high. I ain't even getting myself that credit yet. 
I can look alright. You do you did alright. I'm just like, man. I'm tired of dropping videos. It's like I'm always at the garage. I'm always at the garage. I can't go no we ain't been nowhere. I ain't been able to take y'all nowhere. Uh you gotta go back to like my first videos when it was painted a different color and whatnot. You know what I'm saying? Hey, we, we hit a couple of corners then, but those was like, you know, a, a couple of days before I put it away. You ain't even get to see nothing from when I was riding the, the, the beginning of that summer. You know what I'm saying? When, when, when I wasn't having problems and, and I had my little, my little baby music in there, my 212 with the little, uh, the little 2500 watt monoblock, you know? You didn't even get to see, you know what I'm saying, see too much of the, you know what I'm saying, the fun times when it was painted a different color. I got a little bit, but pretty much as soon as I started uh, dropping this on YouTube, I, I put it away and got to working on it. I ain't been nowhere. You ain't seen nothing. You know, that's why I ain't got no subscribers because they be like, man, you always in the garage. You ain't even been in did nothing. And then I keep redoing the paint over and over and sanding it down, sanding it down. Man, people getting tired of seeing that. <laughs> But man, we get we getting closer, and I'm coming out. I'll be outside in a little minute. When it hit the street, it's still not gonna be ready. I'm be having to do upgrades because my money ain't long. So as time goes, I'm gonna be making upgrades and, and doing, you know what I'm saying? You know, hit, hit, you know, remixing it a little bit. So you just gotta stay, hey, stay with me if you messing with me, pimp. Cause I know we ain't been nowhere and did nothing yet. But pimp, I, I, I'm telling you, I'm about to. I just gotta get outside. I'm about to show you what my life be like when I hit the, when I, when I come out here. And we ain't even dropped the motorcycle. You ain't even got to see the, the, the biker. Man, I got so much in store. You just hold fast. And I'm starting to get more connected with people in, in different places. So man, when I get to roll out and, and link up, man, it's gonna be different. This is about to be different. It's about to be epic out here, you know? So stay with me. I'm gonna get with y'all in a minute. All right? Man, I told him the truth I stay away from the things that be causing me trouble Just out here enjoying the view Hey, YouTube, man. Hey, check pimping out. Check me out. I got some little rim. You know what I'm saying? I got some baby rims, but it, it's clean, though. Hey, I got some baby rims, but it's clean. You better not say nothing about it, neither. Straight up. You better not say nothing about it. I don't want to hear none of that. Hey, Pimpin' got an iPhone. I don't even know how to turn the camera around. Oh, let me see. Hold on, hold on, wait. Let me get out the sun, cause I can't see nothing. Let me get out the sun, cause I can't see nothing. Hey, check me out. Here they go. That's what the grill looking like. It, hey, it ain't in there. I just got it sitting up there though. Coming. 
Hold on, let me hit it. Let me hit it like this real quick. Hold on. 